Oh hi! Hello, welcome are you guys. To the Q and J. Welcome to the Q and J. Um, so last week was Halloween, and we thought it's never too early to start celebrating Christmas. Christmas. So we've got our Christmas sweaters on. We plugged our wallflowers in with holiday scents, and it is time to get Christmas going. <laughs> Sorry, we Matt. literally put the the pine tree. What is it? Fresh balsam. Yeah, and, it and smells it literally like it smells, smells like Christmas in here. Like Christmas trees in here. So which is awesome. So let's get this holiday season Q and Q&A started. started. What would you do if one random fan appears at your door to stay for some time with you? I call the police. I value my privacy. Um, yeah. I post videos online, but that doesn't mean that I welcome everyone into my home. Like we love our fans, but like. That's a level of creepy. Home is home. And yeah. <laughs> that's only for the orphans, you like, guys. Yeah. We go to playlists and we go to VidCon and all these things to meet people. And that's where we would love to meet you or maybe when we're out and about. I love meeting people. Just not at my house. But if you find out where we live and you come here, that's creepy. And then we have to move. Yeah. Then we gotta go. <laughs> we gotta go. You gotta go. And I don't know. It's gonna be no fun for us. <laughs> What is your favorite app on your phone? Hashtag Q and Gay. Um, ladies first. Ladies first. Um, the apps that I use most often are obviously Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. Yeah. I don't have any like favorite apps. I think Matt does. Well, I love Clash of Clans. He's I'm always on. Obsessed with that He's game. Always on it, 24/7. But I do love my Starbucks app. It just makes everything oh, shoot, so Matt. awesome. You got the right answer. That's <laughs> my know. new favorite app. Can I redo it? <laughs> What's your favorite app? Uh, Starbucks. Um, that was my favorite app. I think it can be our favorite app. What are your guys' favorite songs at the moment? Love you both so much. Love you too. At the moment, my favorite song is Oh, Santa's gonna come and make your mind this Christmas. It's like you read my mind. Well, well you were on Carrie, of course. Okay. I know you just knew it right when I say word, oh, every single one. Santa's uh, gonna come. The oh, song. Santa. <laughs> that's my favorite part. So that's my favorite song. I'm really liking Taylor Swift's new album. Like, Blink Space is so good. But I'm also liking Leighton Meester's new album. I think it's her first actual album. Um, this one song, Dreaming, I love it. I love it. I've been playing it a lot. She's from Gossip Girl and like, she's awesome. I don't know, I'm obsessed. Would you rather have a time machine that only goes back in time or a time machine that only goes forward in time? Wait, first of all, are we the same age? Oh my gosh, Matt. Like, do we stay the same age? I have the perfect answer. What? I want to go forward in time, go on the internet, Google the lottery winning numbers, and play the lottery. But you can't go back in time. No, I can go forward in time. But I'm not allowed to go back? Yeah, so you wouldn't be able to go back. Oh, I thought it was like I got to go into the future, see my future, and then come back. I don't know. Well, I'm going to answer as if that's what's going to happen. I'm going to go forward in time, look up the lottery tickets, come back in time, <laughs> and then win. Sorry, it hurts when I smile sometimes. Um, I just thought of something. I would definitely go back in time, and I would just steal your virginity over and over and over. I'm like, you're a virgin again! Well, I'm, like, I'm like, what do you mean again? <laughs> I'm like, I have not had sex yet. Virgins are more a minority than gays. Ever thought about getting matching tattoos? Have we ever thought about getting matching tattoos? I haven't, but... I have not either. I was thinking Nick can get a tattoo, like, right here. Oh my gosh. That says Matthews, and I can get, like, one right here that says Nick's. You know? That's what you were thinking? I think that's a great idea. So then people, well, nobody would really see it, Never mind. But people would see yours, because yours is a tramp stamp. So every time your shirt wrote up, they're like, what does that tattoo say? And they'd be like, is that Matthews? Shake it up, shake, shake, shake it up. <laughs> okay, I don't think that's going to be happening, but I guess Matt has thought about it. If you could have a threesome with Harry or Louie, who would you choose? Harry! Now, now, I feel like this question has been, like... Asked a million times. Stretched a little thin, but obviously I would have a threesome with Louis. Harry! I mean... Common sense. Oh my gosh, Matt. You can pick Harry, and then we get to have a threesome together with Harry. I pick Louis, and then we, at a different time, we get to have a threesome with Louis. We just beat the system. High five. 
That's what I call a greedy bottom. <laughs> what do you think you guys will do for your next anniversary? Well, it's actually tomorrow, so happy anniversary. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> it's our 15-month anniversary. Oh my gosh. You're like one of the parents that after they they turn 12 months old, they're like, my son is 52 months old. Yeah, that's me. That's Matt. Um, I think we will probably watch movies and cuddle. Watch movies and cuddle. That sounds like a great day. That'll be tomorrow, but for the next big uh, yeah. anniversary, we'll probably do something really fun. Is that our two year? Yeah, or one and a half. Oh, we can do something for we a one and a half. We can do something for one and a half. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I love reasons to celebrate. I just burped and it was not cute. <laughs> if all the Labradoodles in this world suddenly disappeared, what puppy would you choose? Okay, who asked this question? Ooh. Who wants lasagna? <laughs> and who asked this question? Because so what kind of puppy would you choose other than a Labradoodle? I would choose a poodle. A poodle? A poodle? I wouldn't choose a lab. You would choose a poodle? Yeah. Because a Labradoodle is a lab and a poodle? Yeah. Are you for real? What would you choose? Like a husky? A husky? Those are so big. Like a husky with like beautiful blue eyes. Oh, so cute. Final question! The final question? What is the final question? Read it. If your life was a movie, would you rather it be Saw or Final Destination? Oh my gosh. How twisted are you? <laughs> well, I would rather it be Saw because I would be Jigsaw. You know? Because... Oh my gosh, no, I don't get to be Jigsaw. No. I would be one no, of the- No, you would be one of the people trapped in Saw. It'd probably be like Saw too, because it'd probably be inside this apartment. <laughs> would you help me? <laughs> would I help you? Yeah, like, I don't know. Give me pain medicine for when I have to saw my leg off? Yeah. And not give the other guy pain medicine? Yeah. Thanks. You're okay. welcome. I'm gonna and choose I would saw. Watch. Well, if I choose saw, I have a chance of not dying. We're in Final Destination, I'm definitely gonna die. All right, you guys, that is all we have for you today. We post King Gays every single Friday, so you make sure you follow us on Twitter so you can submit your questions and subscribe. Okay? And subscribe. Um, I got new bracelets there at nicolaz.com. Go check yeah! them out. They're cute and cool. And we are doing Lush Mist. 25 days of Lush Mist starting on December 1st. So we will be vlogging, doing collab videos, all the above new for 25 days straight. New video from December 1st to December 25th. But what we are gonna try to do, we're gonna try to have new Christmas sweaters for every single video. Um, so we put a couple up on the Amazon wish list if you wanna help us out. The link is below, and we will see you next week. Okay, bye! I mean, tomorrow. Bye! <laughs> dun, dun, dun. What do you think you are? Some type of romantic boy? Oh, look at this. This is the night.